No, it's times like these where you're sitting in the tier six queue and you're just you're just asking yourself, why are we still here? Just to suffer? And the answer to that question is forty two, obviously, which is also just so happens to be the answer to the life, the universe, and everything. So um yeah. Watch this. We're going to hit the 42 second mark and we're going to get a match. Just watch this. 41, 42. Okay, never mind. Uh, we're just going to sit here playing Q Simulator. Ain't that right, Stewie? We're going to play Cat Simulator, which that actually reminds me. Like, I should look that up on Steam and just see if that, like, if there's an actual game called Cat Simulator. Because I, I'm interested in, uh, Simulating the life of one Mr. Stewie and seeing what his, uh, what he does, which is apparently, like, cats sleep, like, 16 hours a day, which I believe, because cats just love sleeping, because, uh, well, I mean, cats, that's, that's pretty much it. But we finally, after a minute of, over a minute of sitting in the fucking queue, we finally get a fucking game. And it's a standard battle, because of fucking course it would be. But, uh, let's take a look at the matchmaking. Independence for carriers. There's only one battleship to farm, which is a little annoying, but whatever. Uh, some tier 5 cruisers that I can citadel with AP, because, uh, Lamau tier 5 cruisers. Hatsuharu, Gupard, Vastras, uh, and T22 for destroyers i have n i honestly have no idea how the hell to pronounce that so we're just going to call it that for right now uh we have a blacklisted omaha which is always an amazing start uh and there's not even any cap circles to fight over which is like really annoying because i fucking hate standard we literally sat in queue for over almost like a minute 30 just for this so that is really unfortunate but we're just gonna have to deal with it so game plan is as of now press w and walk at them and see what happens uh i will absolutely outgun all but three of those destroyers the only question mark is this goop hard because i am also obviously a goopard which means picking that fight is going to be a very dangerous prospect because i have no real advantage other than whatever friendly ships might be over here because this guy's not gonna fucking shoot his guns so that's for damn sure uh it's actually very interesting that we haven't spotted anything uh what is our carrier afk no he's just flying around in spawn so, that's a thing. Do you get hard detected? I really wanted to hit a reload booster right there, but I was expecting he's just going to do exactly that. And smoke up. And there's that guy. That is really unfortunate. We're just going to launch torpedoes out on these guys. We're going to get turned away. I'm going to get into a kite away position. And hopefully some of these torpedoes will land on this guy. But it's not looking like it. You did get uh, hard detected there for a few seconds. So that means the uh, T-22 did leave his smoke. Uh, shit, this could be bad. Uh, okay. This is a little suboptimal. Our only hope is going to be, uh, if this guy decides to sh that he would rather shoot at the Mutsuki in his mouth than, than me, which he's of course not going to do. So we're just going to have to deal with it ourselves. 
There we go. Give me my engine back, please. Uh, what? Though, what, uh, torpedoes could those have been? There's not the Hatsuharu, it's not the T-22. Uh, could it have been the Gepard? Possibly. I, uh, in the heat of, uh, there's a fucking cruiser in my mouth, I didn't really take that good of a look at how many torpedoes there were, other than there was torpedoes there. I'm gonna have to deal with this guy, although between myself and this Graf Spey, we should get him just fine, although I don't have a reload booster, which is very unfortunate. And what the hell is our Gupar doing right here? What the fuck? We have all fucking destroyers right here. Hello? We have a fucking two Gupards and a Mutsuki, like, right there. By the way, is that good? Turn off our AA again. And I... Mm, there's, a, there's a cruiser right there. I really don't want to walk at this Hatsuharu in front of... All of those guys, but these this Hatsuharu is just gonna donate question mark. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna use a reload booster on this because this Hatsuharu is just going to go behind the island, so that would be a wasted cooldown. There we go. Give me my engine boost. Accelerate out of the way of these. Uh I think our play is honestly probably going to be, uh, first of all, playing for this Hatsuharu kill. Uh, if we can get this guy removed from the game, that would be very, very helpful. Uh, and then once this Hatsuharu is gone, we're going to head towards uh, our opposite side, where they have a destroyer and we don't. So we're going to go try and fix that uh I am going to hit my reload booster right here, because I want to try and get this guy dead. But, uh, it's not going to happen, because he smokes up. Which is good on him, honestly. Okay. We are still being hard spotted, which is most likely a cruiser, like, right around there. Or, no, it's not the, uh, actually might have been the Mysore spotting us. Uh, there's an ass in cruiser over there. Just gonna get our farm on. This Hatsuharu is... I'm, I want to kill this guy so bad. I'm gonna greed for this. And I'm going to promptly miss everything, hello? And there goes the Mutsuki. Barely not gonna get this guy, Jesus Christ. There we go. What the fuck? Okay, there's an island right there. That is suboptimal. Uh, okay, look. What do we got here? Gupard is the only destroyer left, and he was last spotted all the way down there at the fucking bottom of the map. Uh, Alright. Oof. Okay, this is turning into one of those types of games. This game's not even uh, eight minutes old, and it's already almost close enough to decide it. I mean, they've already lost seven ships in not even seven minutes. Uh is kind of suboptimal if you're them although they have a battleship that's just kind of kind of walking all we have to stand in the way is two light cruisers which are not exactly what you want to have fighting a battleship of any description I mean the Pensacola if you want to be technical is a heavy cruiser just because of the armament uh, Pensacola does have 8 inch guns so it technically is classed as a light or a heavy cruiser, but its hull is very much a light cruiser hull. So, uh, I think our play is definitely going to be just stepping into the cap and trying to get some pressure on that. 
And this Omaha is just going to uh, commit die real quickly. <laughs> and then, okay. I didn't even have to, uh, didn't even have to shoot at him there. And here comes the planes that everyone wants to deal with. 18, 32, 46 damage. These are, these are big, big numbers right here. I really want to try and bag the CV, but I think this Goupard is going to be the more immediate pressing concern. I'm going to predict that he's going to turn out to try and get all of his guns firing on me. So that's what those torpedoes are meant for. I'm going to reload booster this guy. I want my engine boost to come back up, please. And then of course, here comes the planes. Which, to be fair, I am like pretty much right on top of the uh, that CV's mouth, so I guess I understand it. There goes the Gepard. Jesus Christ, go away, please. This Musaur is going to probably die to this Graf Spay. Nice shot. Okay, those are Gupard torpedoes. Alright, can I Citadel a Mysore at 8 kilometers? Let's find out. Nope, but we didn't need to. Alright, it's pelt time, boys. Do, 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 don't mind me. Please give me my reload booster back soon. I'm not even going to worry about that. Fuck you, man. Give me my engine back. Alright. Please give me pens. And of course, here comes the fucking uh, torpedo bombers. Nice shot. Over pens. Love to see it. And we didn't even fucking get. God fucking... Mm. Okay, never mind. That, oh Jesus fucking Christ, these games, man. This is, this is like literally low to your life for you. So, like, Jesus fucking Christ. Okay, I... Okay. I'm, I'm calm, it's just fucking low to your life. So that is going to be enough for me. I will see you tomorrow.